Hello everyone, it's Wooly here, back again with another helpful video on how to transfer files, photos, videos, and all kinds of data from iPhone to PC and from Windows to iPhone. I'll show you four different and easy methods which are simple to follow, as I will be using the latest tactics that are now even faster and even easier than before. So, by watching this video till the very end, you can find out for yourself which one is going to work best for you depending on your needs. If you're new to my channel, please make sure that you click that subscribe button and drop a like on the video, as I am sure it will help you out a lot. So let's jump right into it. Now, if you have ever recorded a video with your iPhone or iPad and wanted to edit it on your PC, or if you have pictures from your camera that you have saved on your Windows computer and want to edit them on your iPhone or iPad, you probably already know that transferring files between the two is more difficult than you may have had expected. Fortunately, there are several methods available for file transfers in both directions between your iPhone and Windows PC. In order for you to select the best option that works for you, I will be taking you through four of the simplest ways to accomplish it right now in this video. Though I should make you aware of the fact that we will be considering several different options to choose from, it is possible that you might find only one of them that works with your workflow really well. Therefore, before you go ahead and test out the first one that you will see, I would strongly advise that you sit back and check out all of the methods and their possible outcomes shown in the video, just so you don't get anything wrong when transferring the files. So, the first couple of methods I'll go over will be where we are connecting your phone or iPad to your computer via a USB connection, and then I'll show you a couple additional wireless methods that work really well as well. For the first method, transferring iPhone photos to an external hard drive using a USB-C cable. If you happen to be an iPhone 15 user equipped with a USB-C port, consider yourself lucky, as you can easily move your iPhone photos to an external hard drive or a simple flash drive. You can either use a USB Type-C flash drive or even buy an USB to USB Type-C adapter cable, and you'll be fine. So back to the tutorial. Begin by connecting your iPhone to the external hard drive or flash drive, then navigate to your iPhone and open the Files app where you'll find your hard drive listed. Then you can go back to your Photos app and choose the photos or videos you wish to transfer. Tap the Transfer icon at the bottom left. Select the Save to Files option. Mine is already selected. But what you need to do is to tap on Browse and then pick your external hard drive and tap Save. Congratulations, your iPhone photos have now been successfully transferred to your external hard drive. Now this method can work both ways. If you have files in an external hard drive or flash drive, you can just tap and hold on the file that you wish to move to your iPhone, tap on Move, then, on the top left corner, tap on Browse, select On My iPhone, and whatever photos or video files you save there, it will most definitely show up on your Photos app. So that is the easiest method if you have an iPhone 15. For older iPhone models lacking a USB-C cable, we'll utilize Windows Explorer with the phone connected. Begin by plugging your phone into your computer, ensuring it's unlocked. If a message appears on your phone asking you to trust the device, accept it or hit trust for the process to proceed. In my case, Windows Explorer has automatically opened. If it doesn't for you, open a new Explorer window and find Apple iPhone under this PC. Double click on internal storage and within the DCIM folder, you'll find the camera folder containing all your photos and videos. Select the desired files then drag and drop them onto your desktop or into a folder to copy them to your computer. It's important to note that using Windows Explorer for this method is a one-way copy from your device. You cannot copy files back to the iPhone, as indicated by the red marker. This method is solely for extracting files from your phone. However, the next method we'll explore allows for a two-way transfer, enabling you to move files between your PC and iPhone seamlessly. When it comes to wirelessly transferring your files over Wi-Fi, the first crucial step is ensuring both your phone and computer are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. For this process, we'll be utilizing the VLC app, a free and exceptional video and audio player. To begin, identify the specific photos or videos you intend to share. Once you've made your selection, such as this video, navigate to the Share option, proceed to Save to Files, and save it within the VLC app. Hitting the Save button at the top. Upon returning to the VLC app, you'll notice your selected video readily available. Now, 
head to the network section at the bottom, making sure the sharing via Wi-Fi option is activated. This feature facilitates the creation of a wireless connection between your computer and device by simply visiting a designated website from your desktop computer, again, on the same network. Back on your computer, launch your web browser and input the specified number, which in our case is 192.168.1.24. Instantly, the files added to the app will become visible. When prompted to open or save, you should opt to save. This initiates the downloading process to your computer, which happens solely over your local Wi-Fi connection, but it does not rely on the internet. This method provides an efficient way for you to transfer photos, videos, and other content from your device. Similarly, the process works seamlessly in reverse. By placing files in the designated top section, you initiate the transfer back to your phone. If you prefer not to drag and drop, utilize the plus button to manually select your files. Once the transfer process is completed, go back to your phone, open the Files app, navigate to VLC, and there you'll find your transferred file. To integrate it into your camera roll or photos app, long press, select share, then choose save video. Now your photos app boasts various versions of the same file. Okay, let's explore another way to move your files using the internet. We're talking about services like Google Drive, Dropbox, or iCloud. Today we'll focus on Google Drive, but the steps are quite similar for others. To start, open your photos app. Find the photos or videos you want to move. Let's pick this one. Click Share. Go to the bottom and select Save to Files. I have Google Drive, but if you use iCloud Drive, it'll show up too. Choose Google Drive, tap Save at the top, and watch your file travel into the digital cloud. Keep in mind, the speed depends on file size and internet speed, so depending on the case, it could be fast or a bit slower. Once it's uploaded, go to your computer, open the Google Drive website, and there's your file. Right-click, select Download, and it's back on your computer. This two-way method works smoothly back and forth in between devices. Take any file, put it in your Google Drive folder, and watch it upload. Once that's done, on your phone, open the Files app, go to Google Drive, Get your file, click Share, and choose Save Video to put it on your device. But hold on, there's another way. Open the Google Drive app. Go to your file or folder. Click those three dots. Go to Open In, and there you go. Download and export in action. Depending on your internet and file size, it might be quick or take a bit. From there, choose Save to Files, and voila, it's on your phone. And just like that, you're now a pro at moving files between your iPhone and Windows PC using the internet. Comment down below if this video helped you out. And until next time, see you in the next video.